Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everybody. Welcome to What's Up 366, and it is critty critty bang bang time and stage one of the August three way, which isn't the team event I planned because I royally cocked up by managing to delete all of the C category entries without enough time to put it all back in place. So, firstly, an apology for that. Secondly, I'm in a bit of a panic because I left this just about as late as I've ever left joining a race. I've got less than a minute and a half to go. I've done basically no warm up and I forgot my heart rate monitor, so I'm going to get DQ'd anyway. But you know, I am El Presidente, so I'm going to reinstate myself. And yeah, I just feel fat and rusty and slow. Nothing, I, I'm probably forgetting something even more crucial than my heart rate monitor. But anyway. As long as I'm in the game, my bike seems to be connected, screen seems to be recording, we should be all right. So, critty critty bang bang, as always, 14 laps of the downtown Dolphin course. One of my favorite races on Zwift, absolutely love this route. It's a tactical as much as an attritional race and uh, always really good fun. The three way, for anyone that's not familiar, is a three stage race, starting with today's critty bang. Tomorrow we have the mini crit, and then the effectively the queen stage next Monday, which is always the climbing stage. Put all those times together and you have your finishing order in A, B, C and D categories. So tonight is all about getting a good time on your rivals. Oh, oh I've come unclipped, that's great. Here we go, boom, we are off. Best of luck everyone, see you at the finish. Right in front of me, Mr. Shane Blackmore. Great to see you, man. Don't mind if I link and ball on you for a bit, dear. <laughs> I definitely need to hold on to this bunch if I can, because it has Shane Blackmore and Scott Money. Nestled within it. I see Dwight Williams just six seconds behind me. He's got a couple of riders around him, but nothing like the, the numbers I've got in this bunch here. All right, we've cruised up to Mr. Martin Overweg as well. Great to see you, man. If I'm not mistaken, Martin is on a TT bike. Oh dear. Hey, look who's joined the bunch. Mr. Williams. Great effort, man. He's just going straight through. Okay, Dwight's popped, I think. I'm, I'm really fighting to stay here already. 8K in, really feeling it at this pace. Okay, the front group are coming round to lap us. Just, uh, I think we're about a minute and a half behind. Oh man, Ian Nelson's had problems. Looking like he's gonna have to ease up on the group that he's in. So I've got Paul Bailey in front of me with Martin Overweg. Andrew Lawrence, I think that is there as well. Hertier, Reese, Guerrero, something on RGT. Uh, <laughs> that's gonna be Pickles. Okay, Pickles. Uh, Dwight's 10 seconds back, along with Burton and Brown. Oh my bloody screen recording on my Mac. Uh, sorry on my iPad. So it keeps turning off. 
I think it's still working, but it's bloody distracting. Hey, Mr. Eddie Edwards. Thanks for the ride on, buddy. As I kind of forget to use my feather and get dumped off that bunch. What an idiot. I can't chase him back. What a fool. So what, 16 minutes before I crumbled? <laughs> I'm going backwards. And with a big block of riding coming up, it's not good. Ah, oh, I didn't see these guys coming. I was looking back thinking I had a long time before that bunch arrived. Damn it, that would have been really useful. Not that I can ever hold on for much, but it gives you a bit of a slingshot. I have to try and grab this group of bees when they arrive. Cheers, Ralph, for the ride on, dude. So we're past the halfway point. Martin's my closest racer. Uh, sorry, P. Guerrero. Guerrero. And then Martin Overweg. The closest up the road, 14 seconds. A. Burton closing in on me very fast. As are a group of bees that are coming to lap me. I've picked up a draft arrow, a draft boost. So hopefully I can use that to good effect when that group of bees does reach me. Here come the brunge, hit that aero, that draft, put some power on. Okay, that did indeed pull me back to Martin Overweg, getting that draft, superb. I'm not sure if Martin is actually on a TT bike or if it's just the way it's displaying on my screen. I don't think you get power-ups when you're on a TT. And he just used an aero. I might be wrong about that, but just that's from recent memory. I think the next group to lap us are coming up pretty fast. So A. Burton, who I was with prior to that last bunch, I think we'll jump on with them and regroup with me any second now. So again, I'm gonna have to really fight to stay in the bunch. These are some guys that were ahead of me, but I managed to catch up with that draft. Um, Guerrero, Faber, oh no, not Faber. Must have just been Guerrero, so I think Kramer's a lap ahead, yeah. the boat here's the next batch oh I'm getting cramped as well oh man oh, I think I'm gonna cramp up on this climb oh, I couldn't stay with them at all my right calf is locking up ah oh, ball bags Oh, it looks like I was pulling back on Scott Money as well. I think he's managed to, or has he? No, maybe not. So I think he might have grabbed that bunch to pull himself back away. I'm not sure. But if I don't cramp up completely, 
I will definitely be going after Scott if I've got the legs whilst all, all the time keeping an eye on Martin behind me and obviously Guerrero right next to me. And Martin's back with us. Good effort dude. It was about three seconds I think. He did really well to pull back. Along with Faber. Han Hancock is only seven seconds back. Let's keep an eye on that. Burton, likewise. And then we've got another group coming to lap us. The guys I was with at the beginning. Shane Blackmore. Oh, actually no, Shane is further back, sorry. It's Rudy Palsma that's going to come to lap us. Okay, we are back with Scott, who I think probably held up for us, which would have been a wise move, given he was all, all on his own. So it'd be good for him to jump in with this bunch, which he has done nicely. Hancock's managed to put on a good kick up that climb, stretch a, a few seconds ahead. Here's Craig Sybil coming to lap us now. Burton, I said Burton would come back. There we go, great stuff. I'm getting cramped in my left calf as well now. Wow, seriously underprepared for this race. I didn't hydrate in the way that I have been pre-race. I got into a pretty good habit of taking on a lot of electrolytes during my warm-up and actually in the hour before that, I didn't do any of that today. And I think it's really telling. There is Linus Perigis coming to lap us as well. Final two laps. <laughs> going on to the finish here some guys lapping us Brian Roder's in there oh man I don't want to interfere with their finish but I've got to keep a good eye on any of the guys around me getting a jump I think it's all safe and I've got Scott and Martin right by me so going to the final lap I've sprinted with Martin, he's a good sprinter. I'm racking my brains trying to think the last time I had a sprint finish with Scott. I don't remember one, if I'm honest. So he's an unknown quantity for me. Luckily I do have a feather to help me stay with them and save my legs a little on that final climb. Faber, obviously I'm not familiar with. Uh, likewise Guerrero. We've got uh, A Power with us as well now. And S Roma was that I just saw? No, Roma's a lap down. Okay, Scott's dropped off a little bit. Will he be able to power over the top of that climb and get back on? I don't have an error or anything for this sprint. I'm not sure what Martin's got. I am going to cramp up over the line, but luckily I, I won't leave my legs after that. Let's try and stay with favour if I can. 400 to go. Identical time, Martin. Oh man! Ah. 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 
yeah cramp oh jesus cramping both my legs ah. Ah. Oh. mr overweg chapeau dude time to perfection oh we did literally a wheel rim i think ah oh, brilliant oh my good god Oh, well, that's stage one done. Holy hell balls. All right. Ah. Let's go and check out the results. Remember, these are overall results, not the three-way scores or positions. I'll deal with that on Zwift Power and hope that everyone's remembered to put the WKG three-way in there, their username. So, overall win for A. Mark Fogged. Fogged. Mar A. Mark Fogged. <laughs> Second place for JT and third place for A. Lawrence. Well done, guys. That's your podium. Top 10 T. Nagal, L. Walton, N. Long, uh, S. Baus, E. Ranford, and Jon Anderson, one tenth ahead of Kelvin Newman. Now, I know those two are in the three way, so that looks like a battle that's going to rage. Awesome stuff, guys. All right, over to the B's. Let's have a look. We have S. Yarosh, W. Perrin and Jay Peterson uh, I think we can disregard Perrin and Peterson to be honest I'll allow Yarosh and Smith and Mork as your podium so well done guys then we have Viteveen, Strolsham, Rongen, Hellstrom, Molesworth, Pritchard and Van Klinken as your, your top 10 congratulations fellas and any ladies that are in there apologies uh, right my mouse has decided it's not really wanting to work either Oh, crying out loud, come on. Right, C category, we have 3.3, yeah. So, Zizda, Zida, then Klebolt, then Mr. Steve Newton with the podium. Well done, man, that's a brilliant time. Great stuff. And then, Group Inc, no, 3.6, no. S. Bailey, yes. Uh, Dupre, Trow, Blue, uh, no, not Dupre or Trow, sorry. So. Blues Browser, Hertier, Hertier, Sibold, Walker, LP, Rayner, Hackbath, and Scruton. I think that's probably 10 after I've eliminated the, the dodgy ones. D, <laughs> Mr. Overweg. Right, so he's, got a, he's won the three-way again by default by the fact that I think he's the only D-cat running. I, should, I really should put myself in the Ds because I am not a C at, at all at the moment. Absolutely not. Um, then at least he made it a competition, albeit he still beat me, but by that much. Uh, right, excellent stuff, guys. Let me just, I just want to see anyone that I might be reasonably close to in the three-way. I don't, I mean, Scott Money, uh, he was only, what, six seconds off. So myself and Scott got, got a good battle. Andrew Lawrence is there. He was, yeah, about 37 seconds ahead of me. Good stuff. That's a decent lead. Henry Dijkstra. Uh, another, what's that, another three or four seconds ahead. Oh, good stuff. So they're not a million miles ahead. Rudy Powers was a good couple of minutes ahead. Excellent. LP, uh, crazy, yeah, a different, different planet. Um, right, I can't, I'm not going to go through everybody. Um, I will, like I say, do the results on Zwift Power and um, try and get some rest and relax my muscles for the next one, which comes around very quick. Tomorrow night, mini crit, 7.55 British summertime. And it's a route I've not done. It's the first time I'm going to have a chance to do the, uh, what's it called? The Champs-Élysées, the Paris route. So I'm looking forward to that. And I hope to see you all there. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for racing. And I will see you tomorrow night.